Okay, it's chapter one of the Path to Glory, and we have the Sons of Stromback. That's what they're called. Um, the Fire Slayers from the Vorstag Lodge. Um, uh, you can look at the introductions to the armies if you want to know a bit more. Right, so we have um, we have the general. There he is, the battlesmith looking for an icon. Um, he's leading the lodge. He's His command ability is the generic one, so units wholly within 12 of him can run and charge. Um, we have a rune smiter, um, which is Timu uh, Flamecaller. Um, this is Briarton Blackhand. There's two units of Volkite Berserkers with no name. And then there is the Guardians of the Forge, the Hearthguard Berserkers. We are the invaders uh, today. Um, it's the trap scenario from the core book, from the Path to Glory section, so the forge doesn't make an appearance. Um, but we'll talk through that shortly. So, who's the against? Say hello, Shane. Hi, guys. How are we doing? <laughs> so, what have you brought, Shane? Who have we got? We have got the Blood Gullet tribe of the Meatmaster's Market in the Burning Steps. Nice. Today, so we have Bal Titan Hulk, the Tyrant, who's also the General. We have a uh, butcher, uh, four lead belchers, six gluttons, and the pot. Yep, this is scary. This is scary. Um, so um, we'll have a quick look at the table, and then we'll we'll get started. Okay. So what we've got is the trap. Um, so if we have a look at the table, we've got the the invader is going to come in this section. I am the invader. This arcane scenery, very useful for fire slayers with no no mages. So we're coming this way, then we are being ambushed by the ogres. We've got arcane scenery, we've got a mystical ruin, an arcane ruin, uh, inspiring icon, sinister dragon, an arcane stone, and then some inspiring stones. Um, so yeah, uh, the idea being, it's a bit different to a normal game, each turn, um, I get one victory point at the end of the battle round, I believe it is, for each of my units that are on the table. And Shane is going to get two victory points each time he kills one of my units. Um, this is going to be interesting in the aftermath phase to see what I've got left in my path to glory. Um, but we're going to get set up. But before we do, thank you very much to our international viewers, to the States, to Germany and Spain. For our most viewing internationals. Thank you to Countess Cara, our um, big mama at the moment. She's uh, she's waiting to make a debut and the picture will come. Um, it's not ready yet. Uh, thank you to our uh, members on YouTube and to our VIP patrons and all of our patrons, but in particular our VIPs, Mr. Thomas Stott, Andrew Stephen, Sean McKechnie, The Bazooka, Paul Daduka, uh, Shane Kingston, Gary Stephen, Mark Roberts, Stephen Ramage, uh, our rune smiter today, Timu, uh, to Grant Fraser, John Bayliss, Frost Lords Eric, Alex Rodwell, and our rune smiter, John Bryerton. Thank you very much. Let's get going. Okay, we have deployment. So the invaders had to set up first. So uh, Black Hand. Uh, the Black-Handed has got his two units of Vulkites, wholly within 12 of him for his um, command abilities and whatnot. Uh, and then Timu, um, the Flame Caller, is without his is without his forge because we're invading someone else's lands, and he's got his Hearthguard Berserkers, and they're off to the other side. The Ogres in ambush have just leapt out right in front, 12 away, going to do ogre things. Um, so as we said, uh, at the end of each battle round, for each one of my units that are still alive and on the battlefield, I'll score a victory point. For each one that uh, Shane's Ogres kill, they get two victory points. Um, there is Renown to be had. Uh, if, if my units are still alive at the end of the third battle round, I think it is, they get Renown. So they start getting nice veteran goodies if that happens. And for each of those big hungry guys that kills a unit they get renown 
Um, worth saying that both of our quests for the beginning of Path to Glory is um, find the artifact. So we get points um, based on how many of our uh, units are in our opponent's territory at the end of the battle. So there we go. Um, so you're the invade. Uh, you're the ambusher. So who's going to go first? I will go first. Okay. Well, we'll 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 uh, get ready, and we're going to try some different type of filming here. So. Um, yeah. That doesn't work, Stuart's suggestion. Yeah, my fault. Okay, so we've uh, generated our command points. Um, because I go second, I get two. And because my general's on the battlefield, I get an extra one. Because Shane went first, he gets one. And because his general's on the battlefield, he gets an extra one. So what heroic action are you going with? I will try heroic leadership on a four up to get another command point. Cool. It's not four. No joy. No extra joy. So my general is going to... Uh, actually, um, this guy is within an inch of the arcane. So he's going to um, do that. Where can he go? Uh, he's going to do heroic willpower. Pick a friendly hero that is not a wizard. And then I can try to unbind a spell. So that's what I'm going to try and do. With that guy. With that guy over there, yeah. So he's got a 30 inch range, so he'll be in. So, spells. Yes, we'll go for Blood Feast, which is on a 7. Okay, dokie. I believe. Yep, there. and you'll get a plus 1 because you're within an inch of your pot. So, on a 10. A 10. <laughs> so, I'll try and get rid. Uh, on a 4, plus 1, 5. No joy. So that was. So he will be casting that on the six gluttons there. Okay. Which means they get an extra attack to all melee weapons. Nice. Until the next hero phase. Oh dear. Okay. And because they're part of the Blood Gullet tribe, Blood Gullet Butchers get a second spell. Yes. So he will also attempt to cast Ribcracker, which mm. again is on a seven. That's a 13. Yeah, that's that's three. Oh, I can only try one dispel. Um, so pick an enemy unit within 18, and it'll yeah. be the front, front. Yeah. rank of berserkers there. So if they're within 18, they get minus one to their saves, and they are within yeah. 18. Cool. And that again, that's all, the, all attacks until the next hero phase. Nice. So minus one to their save. Happy days till your next hero phase. Yes, and the same plus one to their attacks till the next hero phase. Okay, right. Well, we'll go into movement and we'll come back. So, aggressive, aggressive uh, forward march there. So, the tyrant and his six uh, gluttons are four inches away. And the lead belchers have just shuffled behind. Um, they weren't quite within range. They've had to move forward slightly. So, now they are in range, but they won't get the full amount of shots. Um, so yeah, it's a shooting phase. So, um, take it, yeah, you're going to do some shooting. Yeah, so the lead belcher will just go into the front unit of okay. berserkers there. Um, <laughs> that unit of berserkers isn't long for this world, is it? Um, since they moved, it's D3 attacks. So we've both locked, we've both had a think, and we're not going to spend any command points. He's not going to spend the plus one to hit. Um, I'm not going with the all-out defense simply because I've already got rib, rib cracker on me. Um, so I'm minus one to my save because of that. And I'm going to be minus one rend anyway. So yeah, that'll be that'll actually be two because uh, cause rend does stack. But it's going to go straight through pretty much. So anyway, there we go. Let's see it. So how many shots? So 43 shots. Seven. Yeah. And then fours and then threes. Cool. Yeah, I can take that. I can deal with this. Come on. So it's three, three at one rend. Three at rend one, which would take it to a six, but because of rib cracker, it'll go straight through for three damage. So that'll be three damage. Um, uh, normal Vulkites don't get an after save. Um, so yeah, that'll be. That'll be. One guy dead, and one guy taking a wound. Excellent. Okay, so we've uh, taken off one little fella, 
and we have a wound on this little piggy and now your tyrant's gonna shoot yeah so these are just always two attacks fours and threes so one hits three's to wound yeah. one wound at one round okay. so that'll be straight through again for d3 damage oh three damage oh good so he dies and then another guy dies so that is three already dead it's not looking good for the uh good the sons of stromback good so stuff. we're gonna go into the charge phase yes okay gluttons will attempt the charge first of all okay six so you'll get to do impact hits but i think at the same time i'll we'll, we'll look at the sequence and i get to stand and shoot can you shoot? Yeah, I can throw my shields at you. Oh, lovely. So these guys at the back are going to throw their shields, I think. Not okay. that they're very good. They're pretty rubbish, and you're minus one to hit when you stand and shoot. So um, they're only fives and fives, so they'll be sixes and fives. <laughs> and the tyrant will attempt. Oh, you have to do your impact hits first. Oh, sorry. Because sorry. I'll remove so things to make it harder to charge. Roll the six. So yeah, so six, six dice. dice on a six up and some mortal wound. Yeah. One. One. Uh, so, hmm, not enough. So I will just stick one on this guy That's here. Disappointing. So do your shields now or after uh, all Yeah, I'll, I'll do my... Yeah, I'll do them. I'll do them now. So these guys here will do theirs. They'll do their shields, so it'll be ten. Do I get so. a save or is it instrument? Yeah, yeah. yeah no, oh, no. God, it's not that good. So sixes. Uh, no. See, if it would have been fives, as it should have been, I'd have had a few hits there. Mm. But stand and shoot, um, or unleash hell. Unleash hell with shields and throw them at the floor in front of you, is basically it. So that was a, an yeah. efficient use of a command point. Proud of you. Yeah, so he gets no, to charge. Tyrant will get charge. Oof. Nine. Mm. So we'll move him. Back. So he's in, he's gone into the second unit, so nine impact hits. This could be the end, I think this is going to be the end of both units of Volkite on the turn one charge. One again. One. Okay. So we'll assign a wound. Um, and then at the end of the charge phase, we can do monstrous actions. We have no monsters. So we will go to the combat phase. So at the start of the combat phase, um, uh, Shane and his hungry men are gonna hold on to theirs. Their their, their command abilities uh, come when you activate. He's gonna be using some generic ones. So he's gonna use um, Honor the Ancestors. Uh, spend one command point. So um, it's a bubble effect, basically. Um, so himself and any berserker units within 12 inches get plus one to hit so who are you going to activate first i will choose the gluttons okay so he's piled in um you are going to use all out attack all out attack from the character model yeah the from the the leader in the unit so you've got blood feast on so you'll be on four attacks each and it'll be twos and threes and i am minus one to my save because of rib cracker so i'm on a six up at the moment um whether i want to all out defense them i'll just accept that they're dead and go for the ones behind i think i'm not gonna bother because you've already weakened them so i'm gonna i'm gonna go for i'm gonna save my last uh, command point to all out defense my other boys so Ooh. yeah, okay, so two's to hit. You're a dirty man, you know that, don't you? Learn from the best, this dude. <laughs> Take away the fields. Oof. There's another one in there. Hiding. Okay. Oh, there's some sixes there, that does something. No, 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 we ignore that. Are you sure? No. Yeah, no. pair of clubs or blades, sixes explode. What? So that's one, two, three, <laughs> yes. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh my uh, remember to read your war scrolls, kids. Yeah. So. Grant, so now it's threes. Every successful one that I don't save is a dead, a dead war. It's no nice. So 
So how many is that? Four, eight, ten at no rend. Right, so ten six ups. Four. So I passed two. Um, so that's eight. So that's eight, eight dead, two, and there's four, only two, four, six, six, seven left. Sixteen damage total. Yeah, you're bad now. So yeah, that's them dead. Unit gone. So we'll that's, get rid of those, and yeah. it'll be my activation. So they've piled in. Um, yeah. So I get four guys having to stay in clearance. So I get four guys into the tyrant, and I'll get two into the balls. Uh, two attacks each. I get plus one to a hit, so I'm twos and threes. Um, I'm again going to hold on to that command point because um, I think I'm going to need it when Mr. Tyrant Pants swings at me. So into the bulls first. Um, we're looking for twos to hit and threes to wound because of um, the command ability. So twos and threes. So it's two saves, no rend into the butchers. Needing five ups. No. So two damage. Look at that. Fear us. Fear us. Yes. Alright. This is going to be at all confusing. <laughs> uh, so then into the tyrant. We're looking for twos and threes again. So twos. All but two. And threes. Uh, four. No rend. And because so you've got the fake seeker, he's fake on a seeker, three, he's up. On a three up, yeah. Oh, he Just takes one. a wound though. Get that. But you have got a full pot. Yeah, six if you want. Yeah. No, no. So that is that's my activation. So you get to swing back now. So tyrant will now go. And I will be spending my final command point for all-out defense. Plus one to the saves. Plus one to the save. Okay, so we're ready. Uh, I've realized now because neither of mine charged, they should be getting plus one to the save because of sling shields. But uh, I think that they would have died anyway, the other unit. Yeah, they would have. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. Totally would have died because yeah. you didn't even bite. So. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so what have you got first? The Thunder Mace is three attacks, threes and threes. Cool. So that's two hits. Two wounds at two rend. At two rend, so they're normally a five. Um, it goes to a four because of all that defense. Uh, well, the two rend are cancelled out basically for my two pluses. So I'm on a five still. And I pass both. Damn. Good. So and then it is the Biscuit or Glaive, so two attacks at threes and threes. Mm -hmm. One hit. Fast at one round. Okay, so I'll be plus one to this, so this will be a four. And they're good. And he will bait. Hits three to wound. Wounds for no round. Uh, so there'll be enough. Uh, you can only ever have plus one, so. Yeah, we don't get it. One damage? One damage. Yeah. So they've taken out. Oh no, one of them was wounded, so he's dead. That was severely disappointing. Well, there you go. But I've used all my command abilities. Uh, so battle shock. That's the end of combat. Battle shock. I've lost a guy. Um, they are bravery seven, which puts them down to six. Um, is there any negatives from your guys? I don't think there is, is there? Unless one of your banners. Oh, your bellower. No. Does your bellower give me a negative? Yes, minus one. So on a six. Somebody will run. No, I'm good. So they live. Oof. And that is. Uh, My turn one. Your turn one. I've got. To, I've got some. I've got to think now, because I can raise his icon. Because he's my generally guy. I thought that was the general. No. No. no this is. Um, I think I've been confused. He's not, because he's got a key in his hand. So this is the general. Now he can he can raise his icon, however then his guys can't retreat. Mm. So I have to make a decision. But we'll go into um, Fire Slayer's turn one. Um, we each get a command point 
because um, we've got our generals on the table. Um, I would have gone two points for taking out your unit. You get two points for taking out my unit, yeah. Um, ouch. Okay, so heroic action. Um, the general is going to try and generate a command point. Uh, he does not. So is my general. He does. He does. Oh, good. So you have two, and I have one. Um, okay, so hero face proper. Let's try and summon something. I've not got my... Uh, summon? Yeah, yeah. My flame spitter. I've not got my, my pizza oven, though, to make it summon on the two. I need to roll the three. So he's going to try and summon his pizza, pizza snake. Yes. Crying out loud. He takes a mortal wound. Yeah. <laughs> how's, that, how's that pizza sauce tasting, Chief? <laughs> oh, crikey, this isn't going well. <laughs> Mamma mia. <laughs> I, think, I think I'm definitely not raising his icon because I want to run away. Because I get a point. Uh, a victory point if I'm not dead at the end of the battle round. I fear that if I stay there, I will be dead. So, yeah, we're going to go to movement. There's no more hero stuff I want to do. I've done my prayer. You only get one. I'm not raising my icon, so I'm going to go to movement. So, it was short and sweet. Um, we went for the rune of being able to move. Fury or whatever it is. Um, uh, is it Fury? Oh no, Relentless Zeal. And I rolled the six, so we get plus two to charge and plus two to move. Um, decided that discretion was the better part of valor and the battlesmith uh, did one so he's running back to where he came from uh, we retreated um, the plus two move helped so it made him a six but you can't run and retreat anymore so they got as far as they could and over there um, they all ran up um, with the plus two and the auto run of six for the um, uh, oh crikey, that, that costs a point actually for the auto run. Uh, oh no, it doesn't. It doesn't cost a point because it's an auto run. Don't. Um, so I don't have to command point it to make it a six. That's just the thing for round one. So that happens. Um, we still have one, two, three, four units on the battlefield. So the fire slayers score four victory points. Um, yeah. And we're going to roll for priority for uh, round two. Oh, 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 the two. The mighty two. Right, I'm going to have a quick think and then I'm going to come back to you. Cool. So, um, I won. I'm going to go first because I'm playing to the mission. Um, you don't start off with glory, we've decided. You earn it. So, <laughs> yeah, we're going to play a bit of Benny Hill. Um, but first things first, I'm going first, so I get one point, and I get one point for my general still being alive, uh, regardless of how cowardly he's being. Uh, Shane gets three, because his general's still alive. Um, in terms of heroic actions, I'm going to try and generate an extra command point. No, nope, he's obviously not heroic enough. Um, do you want to do the same? Yes, I shall. No. Okay. Um, and then I get to do a rune. A rune. I, I just want to run away from you. Um, I'm going to go with... Plus one to bravery. So I'll roll the dice. Uh, no, it's not an enhanced one. So I'm just plus one bravery. Um, hopefully these guys will stay alive. Um, I'm going to go to the hero phase. Um... He's not going to plant his... Uh, no, he will plant his icon. So he's, well, he's not planting it, he's raising it. He's saying, we're tough. Strong back. Um, so they're going to be plus one to save. Um, but they can't retreat. And then we're, uh, we're going to try and summon the, the sauce spitter again. Yes. So we'll get that out and we'll come back. So we've we've set up the the fire spitter, um, yeah, wholly within six, um, and then in the shooting phase, uh, basically I roll dice, 
um, and I'll see whether or not it hits you. So that's that. That's hero phase done. Um, so we're going to go to we're going to go to movement. So uh, movement is done. Uh, what we've got is um, the brave um, battlesmith, the black hand, uh, as as maneuvered himself around here he's decided that's possibly the better way the the volkites are acting as a, a screen to try and hold off these whilst their glorious leader um, takes the path to glory um, over there we've got the uh, rune smiter timu and his uh, the and his flame spitter he's summoned and he's moved round um, and yeah um, that is the end of movement. So we're going to go to shooting. So, uh, six, eight, ten. so I roll 12 dice. How many? Just 12, it's fine. Just 12, you <laughs> uh, And then oh, it's sixes do mortal wounds. Um, we're going to go into this unit here, try and make one of them guys run away or die or something. Uh, so yeah, into them. Just one. No more wound save. No. Didn't kill anyone though. And that's it. That's my turn. Um, so yeah, we go on to more tribes. Turn two. So beginning of um, August turn, um, you're not bothering with a heroic action, are you? Yeah. You can try and make an extra command point just for the point. Why not? No. no. Um, and I will um, I'll do the same. Uh, I'll do the same, I think. Uh, so I do get one. So my uh, my general that I've been All right. gets a special one that he has to use. Um, so yeah, spells. Yeah, we will try to go for blood feast again. Put you on the seven, six, just seven plus one. Yeah, I can't unbind because I don't have so a. So have blood feast. That's so plus one attack. Same. As last turn. Uh -huh. um, oh dear. Here we go with the range of other ones. So that is his spells, I believe. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll call it there. Okay, so um, it's looking a bit worrying. Well, we've got movement. There's some aggressive posture in here. Um, these bulls that have got the extra attack again, uh, staring down the Poor defenceless Volkites. Um, the uh, tyrant used his command a uh, command point uh, to auto run six. The butchers run up as well. Uh, the lead belchers have moved forward to try and do some shooting over there. Yeah, it's it's not looking great for the um, for these guys. But yeah, there we go. So shooting. You moved. No, oh, you're out of range. Well, ran, aren't you? So there's no no shooting, sadly. Oh, oh well. So charges then. Yeah, the gluttons will try a charge. They need a three. They get an eight. Take that. Mhm. Mm I'm going to unleash hell on you again. Mm -hmm. I should have. Uh, I should have used the rune that gives me better throwing for my shields because this is probably my only chance. Three, six, nine. You get to do your impact hits first, actually. Yeah. So you might, they might be like shields. Eight, two. Six. Sixes. One. One. So it's a wound. Uh, let's stick it on the boy at the back. And we'll shoot. Oh, we need on. fives. Sixes. Six. Ho ho. And fives. Nothing. That was a pretty terrible roll. Did you not roll a six there? I had one hit, yeah, but then it didn't wound. Oh, I thought it was just like an insta hit thing. <laughs> oh. oh, heavens no. Uh, well, that's just spiffing then, excellent. Yeah. <laughs> so there you go. So right. combat phase. So So you'll get four guys in. Yeah. So, so four, eight, twelve, sixteen attacks. Take it you'll use a command point to give them plus to hit, or will you be oh, saving it for pluses to save? Because you can only issue and receive one, one per phase. 
Well, let's go shutter broke, all out attack. Okay. So. So four attacks each, hitting on twos. You don't have any rend, do you? Case, no. So there's no point in me going all out defense because they're already in range of the uh, the icon. Oof. This is this is narrative, people. Aye. This is the poor dwarf took a wrong turn, and they're feeling so, the twos and threes. Just two misses, but that four becomes hits. a hit. <laughs> that becomes a hit. So that counts for them and two extra. Good show. It's not, though, is it? It's just bullying. You have pizza sauce that can shoot. It's not quite the same. <laughs> it's exactly the same. <laughs> In threes. Okay. All right. Let's uh, count these up. Six, eight, ten, twelve. Thirteen at no rent. Okay. So it's 13, so they're on a 4 up. I'm going to use their once per battle berserk thing as well. I should probably have said it at the beginning, but I should have done it on the last ones as well. So if they die, they get to attack. A bit like Eric's Blood Warriors. Uh, but these are 4 ups. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So that's 12, 12 damage, damage, isn't it? So that'll be 1, 2, 3, Four, five, six. So yeah, but do you do your bites as well? Yeah, because I think they're all gonna probably die, but we'll uh, we'll see. And I'll work out who can pile in an attack. Threes and threes. Go. Cool. I need to roll another four because it's plus one to the attacks for blood feast. Uh huh. Yeah. Yeah. So that was four four hits so far. So seven. seven. Again. So four more. Four more at uh, no rend. Uh, four more at no rend. Oh, they're off. Saved. Fair enough. So that's 12 damage in total. So it was 12 in total. Um, so I'll just sort this out and do some measuring. Um, so these get to pile in an attack. I may, um, I'm, I'm doing the all out attack. Um, for this phase, so it'll be twos and threes. He's going to issue it on himself, the character guy. Uh, so twos. The Carl, he's called actually. And threes. So just one, two, three, four. At no rend. Needing fives. Three go through. Yeah, I think it's a bit of a funny one now that saves don't stack. They get a plus one to the save for the shield, then they get plus one for the icon. Um, but it's not great. Uh, then these guys will pile in. Um, I don't think that. So it's just going to be another two, four, six. It'll be seven because uh, the cow's one of them. So twos. Good. Uh, so just two. No rend, I assume. No rend, no. Two more. Is that two damage there? Uh, yeah, just one damage each. That guy will be dead as well. Ooh. Right, so um, that's attacks. I don't believe they get anything else. Uh, I'm going to use my um, uh, command point, one of my three, to make them immune to battle shock. Lost two. Bravery. But you're eating, so you'll be bravery eight. So I don't think you can fail. Minus two would be a six. Yeah, so you can't so. fail, you're okay. So we'll clear up this, and then we'll come and roll for some priority. Okay, so we go into the priority roll. Um, we may have missed some things, but bear with us, we've never played these before. Oof, I keep it. You're happy with that? <laughs> Delighted. <laughs> I'm going to take it, I'm going to flee again. Um, but yeah, <laughs> we'll come back in a second for the hero phase. Okay, so at the end of the round I roll a dice and on a, th uh, on a one or a two, the flame spitter decides to go somewhere else. Oh, he's staying, he's sticking about. Okay, so... Um, fire Slayers. 
the honourable and glorious fire slayers. Uh, first, <laughs> first things first, heroic action. Um, the inspiring general is going to do a rousing speech. And he does to get a command point. He will better your speech. He doesn't. No. Um, I'm going to immediately use said command point to rally this unit. So I roll seven dice. And for each six, I get a, a wee man back. Two back. Huzzah. Uh, so they don't have to worry about coherency. They're going to actually stay in the fight. I'm going to use a rune. Um, don't know what runes I've got. Um, I'm going to use the rune of searing heat. Sounds good. It's probably not the best rune, but... Yeah. Great. So how's that rune, Chief? <laughs> that rune's great. So um if the unmodified wound roll for an attack is six, I get plus one damage. Excuse me. Yeah, six is to wound do double damage. Um so that's that been spent. Uh he's gonna use Searing Heat the Prayer on the ledge belchers. This this little piggy. Uh, he's needing a three, I think. Maybe a four, but we'll see. No, it's definitely a five. So they're now minus one to hit until my next hero phase. I'll give them this little shining comet to remind them. Thank you very much. Yeah. Uh, and that is the end of my hero phase. Okay, so movement was quick. Um, the fearless leader has just repositioned. They're still within 12 for the plus one to save. They also get plus one for the shield, so I don't know why I'm bothering. Um... Over here, they've just stayed. Um, he's just shuffled ever so slightly, so he's within an inch of the terrain for the um, six up ward. Um, but he's staying within six of the spitter. So we're going to shoot in. Uh, two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. Uh, it's going to go into uh, this unit here again. They take three. Mortals, no. Yeah, three mortals. Good grief. Good grief. One of them on three, the guy at that end. Yep. Yeah, and that is that. So we've got charges, no charges. Um, so yeah, we're going to go to... Oh, there's a bit of shooting. They can throw the shields. So two, four, five. Uh, fives and fives. That's what you need. Accurate shield. One. No rend. Needing a uh, five, I believe. Five. Five's mm. three. Is he dead? He's dead. Good. Look at that. Right, so combat. So we're away. Uh, we've just read the rule and I couldn't rally them. So um, we're. Uh, I've taken those two guys off and we've reinstated this chap with one wound because we redid the shooting and he passed his save. So that's that. So then we go into attacks. So uh, I'm gonna go with all out attack. Um, yeah, all out attack for a command point. So I'll be twos and threes. Three. I will all out defense. Okay, so twos to hit. Threes to wound, but sixes do extra nothing. So uh, four, no rend. Plus one to save, isn't it? Yeah. So you'll be on so a four, four up. Four. Four. Mm -hmm. Three. Three. So he takes one, and then two onto which guy? How many damage is it? Uh, it was just one damage each. So it'll just be that guy dead because you were just three left. He only had one left. Yeah, he'd taken three. <laughs> Uh, so, which one do you want it on? Uh, Either this guy or this guy. You don't want to put it on this guy. Guy at the far end. Yeah. Cool. So, right. you've so got three. I think that the the spell does it still stay still on. Yeah. Hero face, so, so, you've got 12 four, attacks. Four, plus one, 13. Eight. 12, an extra plus one because the Carter yep. leaders in there. Needing threes and threes. Sixes do stuff. You're good at sixes, eh? Uh, better dice, that's fine. It's 
five sixes. That's ridiculous. So they come hits. Two more. Two more. But that two doesn't. Oh, it was our. Oh, was that one of the other yeah. ones? Okay. Cool. You didn't dupe me out any sixes. Did my best. Eleven at no round. Nine, ten, eleven. So this will be on a four up because of the shields and because of the battle stand thing. Uh, so one, two, three, four go through. Eight that's damage two damage total. each though. So uh, that's kind of dead. So I'll whoop, take whoop. those guys off and they get another renown and you get another victory point. Another two points. Thank you very much. Two, sorry. Yeah. So there we go. That's the end of turn and the ogres need a battle shock. They've lost one guy. They're not eating anymore. So on a six one I'll run. No, you can't roll sixes when I want you to, eh? So I score uh, three. Oh no, it's the end of the round, mine score. So yeah. it's not the end not of the round yet. yet. You may kill not quite these yet. guys. So yeah, um, we'll go to hero phase. Yeah. So um, for your heroic action. Just trying another command point. Yeah. Five. Um, my guy is going to have his finest hour, so he'll be plus one to save, and he'll be um, plus one to wound. So the butcher will try rinse and repeat blood feast on a seven. Yeah. Just. Yeah. So they have the extra attack again. Uh. And then it will. Mystic Shields reroll saves the one, isn't it? Um, Mystic Shields, no, it's plus one to save now. Plus one to save. Yeah. Okay. He will try a Mystic Shields, so about six or something. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Definitely. Um. Him. Okay. So that will in effect make him at two. Two plus Level one. Or is a one always a fail? Oh, one's always a fail. Well, there'll be a three plus. Three up, so now, yeah, it will be a two up then. It'll yeah, be sorry. a two, yeah. Two up save. Yeah, uh, that spells. It'll be movement now. Okay. We'll be back in a second. So, the the general, Briarton, the black hand, is going to have to tow it with uh, three bowls, three gluttons over here. Um, yeah. Not looking great for... For the other contingent, um, they need to survive this turn if, if possible to get a bit of renown. Um, the Vulkites with no name, no renown have already been wiped out. I don't even know what happens, what we have to roll to see if that's it. I think I'm going to be spending all my glory bring, paying to bring back my Vulkites. But yeah, so shooting. Well, they're attacking them. 43 shots. Six, seven. So yeah, that would be fours and fours. Oh, four and threes actually. Oh, is, is Unless it's to minus to wind, is he? No, no, it's no, not minus to wind. Fours and threes, sorry. No, no, six, I don't think. No. Two at uh, one round. So half guard berserkers are a five up, so it'll become a six up. Uh, nope. For two damage. Two damage. So because they're within twelve of a hero, they get a four up shrug. No. Uh, so they take one. Ooh, that's curry. The sound of curry. God. This is the it's sound. Been two hours already. Jeez. Of curry. No, no, it's not. Get plenty of time beforehand. So yeah, Tyrant. Yes, Tyrant now. Two shots. Fours and Fours threes. Fours and threes. Both. Six and five, that's good. Threes. One at one round. Six. Nope. Four. D3. Three. Oofed. So take two. So two, one yeah. dies. And one passes over. Cool. Yep. So that's gone. That's 
bent. Yeah. So we'll go to charges now. Charges. Start with the gluttons up top. Oh yeah, needing a board, did you say? Yeah. They're in. Take that. So we just shunt them. Preferably so he can't escape if he's still there. Okay. Mm. So we'll do their impact hits first. Yeah. None. None. And what you need over there? Plenty. Seven to be in half an inch. Okay. Well, six with that little bit, maybe. Yeah, it's a minimum six. Yeah. Excellent. Definitely. Excellent. Two. Two. So, four ups. Yeah, it takes one, so that's the guy dead. The guy dead. Yep. He's not going to get there. Okay. Okay. So who's going first? What are you going with first? Go with the glutton, because I want rid of that guy. Okie dokie. I think. He's already plus one to his save, so there's no sense in me doing that. Mm. And he's, well, he's plus two to his save. Oh, I could have. Thank you. Too late to roll attack on them? No, no, he's not rolled a dice yet. All out attack, which means written on twos. Yep. So twos and threes. So that becomes a hit. Yeah. That six, that becomes a hit. Yeah. That six and mm -hmm. one more. Yep. Oof. Now on three. Could well be a dead boy here. Mm, not necessarily. Well, they're two damage each. He's only got Seven. five wounds. Seven art, no rend. Okay. Three, five, six, seven. So he is going to be three up. Um, yeah. So he fails two. So I have four damage. Okay, so I think he's on one wound. Don't you so you can bite him to death now. Instead of all attacks, it'll be twos and threes again. Uh huh. For the bite. Two. Two. Mm, need three. Get some. He lives. The berserkers are gonna go. Right. right, so they are threes and threes. Um I am going to Sod it. I'm just gonna I'm gonna all out attack. So I'm gonna be twos and threes. Uh so twos. A couple of ones there, it's good. A couple of ones, great. I'll move that down a bit. Threes. Uh, so that's four at um, rend one. And sixes. No sixes though for the uh, explosions. Failed three. So that's six damage. How much? Just two each. You can say nothing. Uh, how many do I say? Two, two, four, six, and one extra, needing threes and threes. Okay. Oof. Does a six do anything? No. no. Yeah, some threes. So four. Four at round one. Round one, so sixes. And then six damage total. Six. And then fours. Oof. Good. So that's a, that's the unit. Good. Yeah, I did not expect that. So that's that unit. So he may as well pile in. Oh, I would have got a cut. Oh, no. I wouldn't. Right, so... Here you go, Tremble, Tremble. He's got four attack, uh, one attack with his latch axe. Oh my god, is that all he is? He's shite. Uh, so, he's going to go all out attack. So for fours and threes, all out attack, fours, threes, 
That wasn't even a four, was it? I was going to say, you that said wasn't even a four. four. <laughs> I'm looking at him, I'm like, hmm. <laughs> and then it, with his runic, his runic iron, um, <laughs> his threes and fours, so it becomes twos and fours. Both hit. Oh, and a six. Does that do something? Uh, his Voss Axe, it's rend one plus one damage it on unmodified sixes to hit. So. Oh, so it doesn't do anything anyway. So that's a one and a two, by the way. Yeah, that's hee Yeah. So, yeah, he's great. So that was that. Um, but no, that was pretty devastating. So you're going to score two, two points for killing them. And your lead belchers get a renown. And I'm going to score two points. For having two units left. For having two units left. So we and all... I also get two renown. One for each of them because they're alive at the end of the third turn. Right, mm. so a having been absolutely humped here, I need to try and uh, withdraw from this battle. It was always going to be a bit one-sided with these big angry gluttons. Um, so I really need to win priority now. Um, otherwise, I'm going to get tabled. <laughs> so here we go. Five. Okay. So it's my hero phase. I take it. I withdraw from the battle. I concede, sir. <laughs> so you get to play out the rest of the battle. Um, but there's nothing... Oh, you were minus one to, to hit as well with your uh, guys. But we did that, didn't we? It was mm. just the wounds. You didn't. So yeah, I run away. Well done. You win. Chicken. <laughs> Check in, I've got nothing left. You've insulted the I've got, fine I've name got, of dwarfs. I've got my, my general on one wound and my priest on four. I think at this point, the only sensible option is to withdraw it's from the sensible battle. option is to stand and fight like a real dwarf. No, no. I think that there's going to be no path to glory. We're going to hit a dead end if we stay any longer. It's going to be a very short path. So we're going to go through the aftermath phase, eat some curry, um, and come back. So, that was a, a legitimate outcome, wasn't it? Everybody's happy with the outcome. No. So we looked at it, and um, withdrawing tactically from the battlefield is a legitimate tactic. It really is. And um, at the stage that we withdrew, um, me winning that priority basically meant I could withdraw before getting killed. I didn't manage to score any more points, but I did then deny. Um, I, it doesn't say that you destroyed. Technically, I suppose you are, but you're not. You don't get any bonuses for being on the battlefield at the end. People say what they think. I'm pretty sure people will go with shame, but rules is rare. No. <laughs> I'm taking it. As they say, the rules are martial guidelines. Yeah. So I'm saying that it's not a valid win. I think, I think it's a legitimate win. I mean, I was totally smashed. We've done the aftermath stage. Um, one of my Vulkite Berserkers and one of my Half Guard stayed a casualty, but I used my once per aftermath phase reroll on my Half Guard um, to make him not. So I'm at full strength except for one Vulkite. Ah, 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 ah. He's, he's at full strength. Um, he completed his quest because in those last two turns when I was absent, um, claiming the glory, um, Shane <laughs> charged into my territory. He got a quest point for each of the units that were wholly in my territory. So we got that. Meant that you were... You at least you got an artifact, uh, which is good. Um, you're sitting on. You've got an extra six gluttons as well. Yeah. So I'm on four glory after spending seven. And I, uh, I got a gun hauler as an ally. Um, so yeah, I spent one of my glory to re-roll that dice. Um, I spent another glory to get a quest point because I got zero quest points. Shame that. Wow. Yeah, I got some renown. Um, you were 
gluttons that smashed everything became veterans. Got veterans, yeah. Mm. They can run and charge now. Once per battle. Once per battle, but yeah, that's pretty good. So yeah, that's the, the start of a, a long and glorious tale. I'm sure we'll fight again later on in the campaign and uh, <laughs> you'll uh, just make sure that I don't. Not that impressed, are you? I think your followers and patrons should vote who won. And clearly vote for me because Stuart's just gave me. Mm -hmm. What do you think of the career of changing Good. the subject? Aye. Coincidence, <laughs> isn't it? It's a legitimate tactic. Sometimes, when things aren't going your way, you withdraw to fight another day. There is glory to be had in using such tactics. That's not <laughs> anyway, that's part one. See you soon.